Also now at 11, new video of a school fight that led to a shooting in Miami Gardens. Five people, including two teens, hit by bullets. CBS News Miami's Chelsea Jones is at Joe DiMaggio Children's Hospital in Hollywood, where the teens are being treated tonight. She has a look on how this all unfolded. There was a fight at Miami Norland Senior High School that spilled over into a nearby neighborhood and it landed two teens here at Joe DiMaggio's hospital and then three adults across the street at Memorial. Get out! Oh, oh. No! Punches fly outside of Miami Norland Senior High School while crowds watched and recorded. Can't confirm that it happened during school hours, but it did happen at the school. It started at the school. That fight, a catalyst for another fight that happened less than a mile away, which led to the police presence you see here. One of the parents came over to speak to another parent, and that's when another altercation happened. Uh, 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 arguments started, and one of them started, um, someone shot fired. Miami Gardens police say they were called to the area of Northwest 14th Court and 197th Street. The incident led to multiple schools being placed on lockdown until officers had a better understanding of what happened. This map shows you the one mile radius of where this all happened. <laughs> Police say five people were shot in their lower extremities. Two were teenagers and three were adults. All of them are expected to recover, but who pulled the trigger remains a mystery. At this time, we have a person of interest detained um, and we're trying to figure out their involvement. Police say they are taking a closer look at that video and investigating to see if the shooter is possibly in that video. In Hollywood, I'm Chelsea Jones, CBS News, Miami.